Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Book of Science. Today I am teaching about 8th class Biology, 6th chapter, the circulatory system. In this class we will learn about blood groups. There are two types of blood group system. First one ABO system, RH factor. ABO system. Carl Landsteiner in 1900 identified different types of blood groups in humans. Blood groups are classified on the basis of antigens present on the surface of red blood cells. There are two types of antigens A and B. A person has A antigen in his RBC. His blood group is called A blood group. A person has B antigen in his RBC. His blood group is B blood group. A person has both A and B antigens in his RBC. His blood group is AB blood group. A person which doesn't have an antigen, his blood group is O. So, here four types of blood groups. So, this is the simple diagram. This is the RBC. This is A antigen. So, on the RBC, if it is a antigen A, so the blood group is called A. If it is a B antigen on the RBC, it is called B blood group. If A and B antigens present on the RBC, the blood group is called AB. But there is uh, no antigens on the RBC, it is called O blood group. So, this is the antigens. So, this is blood groups A, B, A, B, O. So, there are two types of antibodies. We know the antigens A, B. So, antibodies also two types A, B. If a person has A antigen, the antibody is B. It means opposite. So, antigen antibody is opposite. If a person has A antigen, Antibody is B. If a person has B antigen, his antibody is A. Antigen and blood group is same but antibody is opposite. This is very important point. Antigen and blood group is same. For suppose A antigen, so A blood group. So it is same but antibody is different. Antibody different means B. So, here I will give some examples. A antigen present, A blood group. B antigen present, B blood group. A and B antigen present, A B blood group. O, there is no antigens. So, it is a O blood group. Antigen A has antibody B. So, antigen antibody is opposite. So, antigen A has antibody B. Antigen B has antibody A. So, here this is the small table. Blood groups, antigen, antibody. Blood groups A, B, A, B, O. So, in the A blood group, antigen is A. In the A blood group, antibody is opposite. So, antigen A, so opposite B. In the B blood group, Antigen is same B, but antibody is opposite A. In the AB blood group, antigens A and B, but the antibody is nil. No, there is a A blood group have no antibodies. O blood group has no antigens, but antibodies A and B. So these are uh, opposites. So AB has a no antibodies and O blood group has no antigens. This is the small table. Next, donor and recipient. Donor, a person who gives blood to other person. He is a donor. Recipient means a person who takes blood from the others. He is the recipient. Blood transfusion depends upon recipient antigens, donors antibodies. This is very important point. Blood transfusion occurs. The recipient. Who is the recipient? Recipient is the patient. Patient blood is antigens. 
it depends upon the patient's antigens but the donor antibodies depends on the donor's antibodies so here a blood group person can be given to same blood group a and ab also b blood group person can be given to same blood group b and ab also ab blood group person can be given only ab o blood group person can be given to all blood groups it means a b ab and o in these four types of blood groups we will watch ab takes blood from others but he didn't give to others okay ab gives only the same blood group ab but don't give to others but o blood group gives the blood to all other blood groups but he didn't take the blood himself so a gives a and ab b gives b and ab ab give only ab o give to all blood groups so what is a universal recipient what is universal donors universal recipient ab blood group person can receive blood from all types of blood group persons so he is called a universal recipient so recipient means he takes the blood from others but he didn't give he only takes the blood from others so ab blood group is the universal recipient universal donor universal donor is o blood group why because o blood group person can be given to blood all blood group person so he is a universal donor here this is a table we can understand here donor here recipient what, uh, what about the blood transfusion about uh, depend upon uh, recipient antigen donor antibody here this is the donor blood groups a b a b o recipient blood groups a b a b o if a donor blood gives to if the blood is matched we will tick the correct match we will tick correct if the blood is not matched we will use the wrong okay the wrong mark if it is matched we will correct and if it is not matched the blood group we will use the wrong mark first one donor if a blood group donate to a same okay try to understand it a blood group gives to a and ab okay a blood group gives to a and ab but it didn't give to b and o okay next b b blood group gives to b and ab but didn't give to didn't uh, match to the a and o ab blood group ab blood group only donate the blood to same ab so a b o doesn't match the blood o o blood group gives to all blood groups so tick the all so this is the main table here we will learn another here blood transfusion depends upon recipient antigen recipient antibody here a blood group antibody b b blood group antibody a a b blood group antibody no o blood group antibody a and b okay here a blood group gives to a why because the antibody is b so matched antigen and antibody is different so it is matched here b a blood group doesn't give to b why the antibody is b antibody and antigen so it is not so it is same so that's why it is not matched whenever the antigen and antibody is opposite then 
the blood is matched so here this is blood group and antigen okay blood group and antigen is same so antibody also b so antibody antigen is same so the blood is not matched here ab antigen ab antigen a and b so b is present so a and b so it is matched so in, in this uh, method we will learn this uh, table here b b blood group has a antibody okay so uh, antibody a antigen b so it is matched okay here ab ab has no antibodies no antibodies so it is only match with the ab blood group o has a a and b antibody so it gives uh, all blood groups blood fusion this is the excess matter of the students blood transfusion some surgical operations accident excess bleeding loss of blood etc causes leads to blood transfusion blood is taken from a healthy person that person is called donor donor and recipient blood groups must be matched uh, donated blood is already tested for any infections to avoid harm to the patient diabetics cancer patients don't donate their blood because of already they have a health related problems so the so they didn't give the blood to uh, patients or other any persons the collected and tested blood transfused to the patient patient means recipient the transfusion of blood from donor to recipient is called a blood transfusion if the donor's blood is not matched to the recipient the donor blood stick together and stop the blood flow leads to danger of patient life reaction of antigens donor's blood and antibody of recipient blood